today I'm going to teach you guys how to download and burn Xbox 360 games. So first, open up your internet browser. Then, what you do is you go to xbox360iso.com. I'll put that in the link description in the thing on the side of the post. Now, what you need to do is you need to sign up or else you will not be able to get to any of the forums. So sign up right here. I already have a name. There. And now it will automatically bring you back to this page. What you need to do is, you need to go all the way down until you see Xbox 360 game downloads. This is the fastest one. Now, if, um, if you see stuff like this, um, this is good because it'll have games from Mega Upload and Mega Upload is a fast downloading website but if you happen to not find a game that you like there and you see it in this rapid share like a rapid share link like these um, it might be okay, say that you want Burnout Paradise you let it load up then you come down here. As you can see, there are multiple parts. And say you don't want to wait that long. What you do is, you go to this website. I'll also put it in my link description. Internet Explorer is full of stuff. Okay, it's called Rapid Share Downloader Info. What you do is, you put the link inside this box right here, and you click download. You can download up to as many as you want at a time. And once you do that, you you have a downloader file, okay? Once you get the downloader file, it'll be you, it'll be a DVD and RAR file. As you can see, uh, this is the DVD file and this is the RAR file. What you do is you exit out and you go to Image Room. And what you do here is you go to Tools settings, right, and right here in this option box, you go to user specify. Now with that DVD file, you open it up in notepad, and with notepad, you copy, and you paste it in there, you click OK. You do that, you click right image file to disk. You go here, you go to, you go to the box that you have it in. See Left 4 Dead, I downloaded that this morning. You click the DVD file. Well, you don't have to click it, but it'll automatically send it to you. Watch. If you click this, it'll give me a file. You should have selected the DVD file and not this one. I'll do it for you automatically this time, but don't do it again. It, that doesn't really matter. It'll automatically give you the DVD file every single time. Now what you do here is you select your DVD drive. You can click verify just to make sure that the, the DVD that you had written is not damaged or anything. And what you need is a DVD dual layer 8.5 gig disc. Uh, verbatim is the best. And what you do is you click 2 or 2.4. Those are the best right speed. And when you put a disc in, they'll say to burn it. You click that and you wait until it's all done. And when it's all done, you're ready to play. Um, if you would like more help on this, um, leave comments in the leave comments below, or and subscribe to my channel because I will have me actually uh, burning the game and playing it for you if I get more requests on it. So just have fun and subscribe.